Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the error underscore network underscore changed in Google Chrome error you might be receiving. So you might be getting this in other web browsers as well, but I thought I'd just do a brief little walkthrough of how to hopefully resolve this issue for your individual cases. So there's a couple different potential solutions for this problem. The one I would recommend to do first is actually to restart your internet connection. So whether you're using a modem or ethernet connection, I would definitely recommend you reset your network connection by simply just unplugging it from the wall for your router case, or in your computer's case, actually re-disabling your network and then re-enabling again. I find that that seems to work in a lot of cases, for myself at least personally. The other thing, if that does not work, so the second solution for this fix will involve us opening up an elevated command line window. So we're going to start by right clicking on the start button and then we're going to left click on where it says command prompt admin in parentheses. So you want to left click on that. If you receive a user account control window, you want to select yes. So now in the administrative command prompt, you want to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. So ipconfig should all be one word followed by a space forward slash and then flush DNS. There should not be any space in between the forward slash and the flush DNS. Once you're done typing that in, you want to hit enter on your keyboard. You should check to see if your internet connection is working now. If it's not, we're going to move on to our third step here. And that would be to type in NETSH space INT space IP space set DNS. And I forgot to mention it, but there should be a space in between set and DNS. So just make sure you copy it exactly how it appears on my screen. Once you're done typing that in, you want to hit enter on your keyboard. And now you want to type in NETSH space Winsock space reset. There should be a space in between NETSH, Winsock, and reset. So there should be two spaces in between all of this. And then you want to hit enter on your keyboard. And then you will have to restart your computer to save the changes. So I'd recommend closing out of this command prompt window, restart your computer, and see if your issue has been resolved. So I find that this is definitely a good solution if you have an interrupted network connection. It's definitely something you want to check out. So I hope this brief tutorial worked for you guys, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.